welcome to GSC at Home. My name is Harriet and today we're going to be making hovercrafts. Now a hovercraft is a vehicle that uses a cushion of air to float above a surface. We might think of hovercrafts as being very futuristic vehicles, but actually the first one was invented in 1959 by engineer Chris Cockrell. Today we'll be making our hovercraft out of a balloon, a blank CD or old DVD, and a sports cap from a juice bottle or a water bottle. Now, before we make our own hovercrafts, we have to understand a little bit of the science behind them. We're going to look at Newton's third law of motion. Now, Sir Isaac Newton was a physicist and a mathematician who lived in England in the 1600s. He made a lot of really important discoveries, including our theory of gravity, but he was really interested in how forces interacted with moving objects. He created three laws of motion. And the third one is every action has an equal and opposite reaction. For example, this balloon that I've blown up contains a lot of air, but I haven't tied the bottom in a knot yet. If I were to let go of this balloon, all the air inside it wants to escape as fast as possible. It's going to start moving down out of the balloon. But all the force of that air moving down is actually going to push this balloon up and it will fly everywhere. Equal and opposite. Our hovercraft is gonna work in a really similar way, except by using a little cap like this, we can control the airflow coming out of that balloon. First step of making our hovercraft is we're going to need to glue this little sports cap here onto the center of our CD covering this hole. I'm gonna be using hot glue or craft glue. You will want to use a strong type of glue to make sure it sticks on, so make sure you have an adult to help you, whether using hot glue or super glue. So we're gonna have a little bit of glue all around the bottom of this bottle cap here. And we're gonna stick it directly over the hole in the center of the CD. And we're gonna leave it to dry. When that's dried, we're gonna blow up our balloon. Attach the balloon to the hovercraft by placing the end bit right over the top of our water bottle cap. You want to make sure that you haven't tied a knot in the balloon yet because we want all that air to get through. You may need an extra pair of hands to help you. Once the balloon is attached, it should stay in place without any extra help. Feel free to personalize your hovercraft as much as you want. Find a nice clear space to test your hovercrafts. Set them off by lifting up the bottle cap and watch them go. Now that you've made your own hovercraft, try some different experiments with them. Do they move quicker when they have more or less air inside the balloon? Do they travel better over a smooth surface or a rough surface? Let us know your results in the comments down below. Until next time, that is it for another GSC at Home. We hope you've enjoyed today's experiment. If you have any questions, please let us know via social media. We will do our best to get back to you. Until next time, we'll see you soon with more science content and at-home experiments. Thank you and goodbye.